Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video, we will talk about the 10 untold stories of the greatest sports rivalries. Let's get started. 10. Muhammad Ali vs. Joe Frazier Though both fighters were African Americans, race was a major factor in the greatest boxing rivalry, which pitted Muhammad Ali against Joe Frazier. Private friendship existed between Ali and Frazier before their 1971 fight. This changed, though, when Ali, who was well known for his vocal support of black power and cunning psychological strategies, made a concerted effort to paint Frazier, who had mostly avoided speaking out on civil rights issues, as a pawn of the white establishment. In their first fight, Frazier defeated Ali, who had never lost, by decision to keep the heavyweight title. Ali entered the ring for the second time after losing the championship in 1967 as a result of his refusal to be inducted into the army during the Vietnam War. The 1973 rematch saw Ali secure a dominant decision victory over Frazier, who had earlier lost the title to George Foreman. Their competition reached its peak in what many see as the greatest battle in history, which took place in the Philippines in 1975. Ali and Foreman fought for the title, which Ali had reclaimed, and the Thrilla in Manila was a vicious 14-round fight. After fighting through to the end, Ali defeated Frazier by technical knockout in the storied Thrilla in Manila. 9. Michigan Wolverines vs. Ohio State Buckeyes One of the most intense rivalries in American sports, and the biggest in college football. It's the rivalry between the two most prominent and successful NCAA programs, the Michigan Wolverines and the Ohio State Buckeyes. The two teams' first game took place in 1897, and since then, their rivalry has developed as they have fought for conference titles, national titles, and Heisman trophies. Together, their teams have won 10 Heisman winners, 77 conference titles, and 19 national crowns. Other factors that impact the rivalry are the historical and cultural distinctions between Ohio and Michigan two states that have been at odds since the 1830s when they engaged in combat over a narrow stretch of territory known as the Toledo War. The games are always fierce, competitive, and meaningful, with many memorable moments. For example, in the 1950 game, dubbed the Snow Bowl, Michigan won 9, 3 despite 45 punts, 9 turnovers, and a blizzard. Or in the 2006 game, dubbed the Game of the Century, which featured the nation's top two teams. Ohio State defeated them 42 to 39 in an exciting shootout choice. Eight, Boca Juniors versus River Plate. The match is known as the Super Classico, as it matches Boca Juniors and River Plate, the two most well-liked and prosperous teams in Argentina. The rivalry began in 1913 when both teams were established in Buenos Aires's La Boca district. They have since relocated to separate venues, but their intense antipathy has remained constant. The Super Classico is a social and political battle between the upper-class River supporters and the working-class Boca supporters. It's more than just a game. Both on and off the field, the contests are invariably fraught with drama, emotion, and violence. When the two teams faced off in the Copa Libertadores final in 2018, the biggest club championship in South America, it was the most memorable Super Classico ever. The first leg ended in a 2-2 draw, but the second leg was postponed and moved to Madrid, Spain, after River fans attacked the Boca bus with rocks and tear gas. Boca lost the final 3-1 in extra time, and River celebrated their fourth continental title in front of their bitter rivals. 7. Green Bay Packers vs. Chicago Bears The Chicago Bears and the Green Bay Packers have a long-standing rivalry that extends back to before the National Football League was founded. The two teams have played each other almost 200 times since 1921. The Bears and Packers are the most decorated teams in NFL history, with 9 and 13 titles respectively. Furthermore, Notable players from both clubs have made substantial contributions to the Hall of Fame, with Mike Ditka, Vince Lombardi, George Papa Bear Hollis, Curly Lambeau, and others among the inducted coaches. Aside from leaving a lasting impression, the players also became well known for nicknaming themselves the Galloping Ghost, Golden Boy, and Sweetness. Beyond the numbers and folklore, 
This rivalry has strong geographic roots, emphasizing how close the NFL's smallest hometown is to the Midwest's largest city. On their way to holidays on Wisconsin lakes, the people of Windy City are jokingly accused by their counterparts in the dairy state of speeding. Chicagoans, on the other hand, deride Wisconsinites as cheeseheads. It's interesting to note that the latter have adopted this moniker and proudly wear it at Lambeau Field, giving the rivalry a distinctive and lasting quality. 6. New York Yankees Boston Red Sox Few rivalries in Major League Baseball can match the ferocity and drama of the rivalry between the Boston Red Sox and New York Yankees. This legendary competition is entrenched in a tale of curse and redemption that extends beyond the Hall of Famers. The crucial move came in 1920 when the Red Sox decided to give the Yankees their then-dominant pitcher, Babe Ruth. With this deal, Babe Ruth's illustrious career as the Bambino, which was defined by a ton of bandy-legged home runs, and the building of Yankee Stadium began. As a result of this misguided transaction, the curse of the Bambino, the Red Sox suffered through an extended championship drought and gained a reputation as endearing long-term losers similar to the Chicago Cubs. Cue the iconic moment when the ball went between Bill Buckner's legs in 1986. The story took a historic turn in 2004 when the Red Sox pulled off an incredible comeback against the Yankees in the American League Championship Series. After falling behind three games to none, after defeating the St. Louis Cardinals in the World Series, they broke the decades-long curse and permanently changed the history of the Yankees-Red Sox rivalry. This victory laid the groundwork for their eventual redemption. 5. Celtic FC and Rangers FC the rivalry started in 1888 when the two teams played their first game. Over time, it has grown stronger. The rivalry also stems from the political and theological differences between the supporters. Rangers symbolize the Protestant and British communities, while Celtic represents the Catholic and Irish cultures. There are many instances of violence, vandalism, and intolerance both on and off the field, making the matches always tense, confrontational, and combustible. The most famous encounter took place in 1980, in the Scottish Cup final between the two teams. Celtic prevailed 1-0, and the victory set off a large fan riot that resulted in hundreds of injuries and arrests as the fans invaded the pitch and clashed with them and the police. 4. India vs. Pakistan – Cricket This rivalry is among the most passionate and politically charged in sports. It's the rivalry between two of the world's most powerful and populated countries, India and Pakistan, as well as two of the most talented and fervent cricket teams. The two sides' first ever test match took place in 1952, and since then, as they have battled for cricket glory, winning a combined four World Cup titles, three Champions Trophy titles, and two World Test Championship trophies, their rivalry has grown stronger. Along with their shared history of four wars and numerous border skirmishes since their independence and partition in 1947, the two nations' political and historical conflicts have an impact on their rivalry. The matches are always tense, emotional, and unpredictable, with many memorable moments. For example, in the 1986 Austral Asia Cup final, Miandad of Pakistan hit a six off the final ball to win the match. In the 2007 World 2020 final, India's Joginder Sharma bowled a low full toss to Pakistan's Misbah ul Haq, who then scooped it to Srisanth at fine leg, giving India a five run victory. 3. Boston Celtics and the Los Angeles Lakers There have been 12 NBA finals meetings between the Boston Celtics and the Los Angeles Lakers. They tower above the competition in terms of Hall of Fame inductees, some two dozen each, and championships, 17 for Boston and 16 for Los Angeles. Think about a better personal rivalry than Wilt Chamberlain vs. Magic Johnson or Bill Russell vs. Larry Bird. What about increased entertainment value and symbolic drama? Exhibit A. In the 1950s and 1960s, Red Auerbach lit his victory cigar on the Boston Gardens parquet floor. Exhibit B the sleek-haired Pat Riley directing the Lakers' 1980s Showtime at Armani. In addition to being highly complicated, the competition also involves race. The Celtics featured a disproportionately white roster during Johnson and Bird's 1980s battling. 
during a period when African-American players had come to dominate the game. Fans, white and black, took note, but not in the context of a substantive national conversation. However, the Celtics had a starting lineup with at least four black players two decades prior, which was uncommon at the time. However, Boston, a hub for abolitionism in the 1800s, was also the site of obnoxious anti-busing protests in the 1900s. 2. New Zealand All Blacks vs. South Africa Springboks This rivalry is the fiercest in rugby union and among the most illustrious and courteous in all of sports. It's the rivalry between the All Blacks of New Zealand and the Springboks of South Africa, two of the most successful and powerful rugby teams in history. The two teams have competed in the Rugby World Cup, Rugby Championship, and Bledisloe Cup for nearly a century. They have a combined record of five World Cup titles, nine championship titles, and nine Bledisloe Cup titles. The rivalry began in 1921 when the two teams played their first test match. A lot of demonstrations and boycotts took place around South Africa's racial segregation policies during the apartheid era, while New Zealand was against them. And these concerns also had an impact on the rivalry. The games are consistently physical, skillful, and full of hard-fought moments. Two such moments are the 1995 World Cup Final, in which South Africa defeated rivals 15-12 in extra time while wearing a Springbok jersey and cap, and the 2019 World Cup Final, in which South Africa defeated rivals 32-12 to become the first team to win the World Cup after losing a pool match. 1. El Clasico El Clasico is the name given to the rivalry between Barcelona and Real Madrid, the two most successful and powerful clubs in Spain and Europe. The two first faced off in a friendly match in 1902, which is when their rivalry began. Since then, they have played more than 280 times, with Real Madrid somewhat outnumbering Barcelona. As Barcelona represents Catalan nationalism and identity, and Real Madrid is considered a representation of Spanish centralism and monarchy, the rivalry is partly founded in political and cultural contrasts. Some of the best footballers in history, including Di Stefano, Cruyff, Maradona, Zidane, Messi and Ronaldo, have played in the Derby, the 2005 league match that marked Ronaldinho's ovation at the Bernabeu, and the 2011 Champions League semi-final. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. That's all for today. I'll see you next time. Bye.